a very good morning to one and all present here. In today's virtual world, I extend my heartfelt greetings to some of the most dearly missed people, not just in my life, but in the lives of all the students across the country. And yes, surprisingly, ironically, that includes all the people that we students used to run away from. So good morning, Reverend Principal, respected Vice Principal, dear Headmistress and all my lovely teachers. The topic of today's debate is COVID-19, nature's wrath towards mankind. And I strongly stand against the motion. Is COVID-19 nature's way of punishing us? Is nature trying to hurt us, kill us, destroy us because of the ruthless, unkind and ungrateful manner in which we humans have treated nature? Well, I know that many of my worthy opponents will tell you that, yes, nature is punishing us for our wicked deeds. They will enumerate endless examples of how cruel and destructive we have been. But my dear friends, nature is but a metaphor for God. And like God, nature is kind, bountiful, generous and forgiving. Like God, nature bears the burden of our follies, yet continues to nurture us with its love and endless resources. In the past, we exploited nature, yet it blessed us with its endless love. Even today, we continue to exploit nature and still nature feeds us through its crops, gives us clean air to breathe, water to drink and a home, this earth to live. Earlier, we threw plastic bags around. And now we have added masks to the list of our endless litter. We continue to waste water and electricity recklessly. We refuse to wear masks, refuse to practice social distancing and thus we refuse to let this pandemic die. It is we humans, not nature, who ensure that this coronavirus continues to thrive so, dear friends, COVID-19 is not nature's wrath towards mankind, but man's shortcomings personified. Or, forgive me, virusified. Nature, that is symbolic of the ever-merciful God, waits for us to return to its embrace so that it can help us heal. The day we understand this, not only COVID-19, but all of mankind's miseries shall come to an end. Let's not forget that even today scientists believe that COVID-19 will truly come to an end when nature helps us to achieve herd immunity. So nature will once again be our saviour by helping us to end this pandemic. With this, I rest my case. Thank you.